Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Checking in on PCLN, NVDA, Tesla, Netflix, and CMG. So PCLN, double bottom down at 17.04 and 17.02. Middle Bollinger Band continues to act as resistance day after day. We're going to have a stand between the 1700 psychological level and the Middle Bollinger Band resistance. We are going to see a break sometime in the next few days, and we'll see who it favors. If it's a bear break, this weekly chart is going to increase the odds that it's a potential bear flag. And if it's a bull break, the bulls are going to look for a higher low at 1700 and then have to break 1777 for a weekly higher low and a higher high to change this momentum and the trend. NVDA seeing a bounce attempt to close up near the high of the day on the inside bar on the daily time frame favors the bulls into tomorrow. 184.84 is support. 190.14 is resistance. And we'll see which direction we break if it's a bull break after 194. After 190.14 is 192.70 resistance. Exponential resistance driving the price down. Bulls need to see some increase in volume and some follow through to have some confidence that the momentum is shifting in their favor. Trying to form a bullish candlestick holding the middle Bollinger Band support. Not trying to lose that for the first time in six months. If we see a green day and a bull break of that inside bar, this will be a hammer on the weekly showing lower wicks, a lower wick of bulls buying the dip. Netflix inside bars, multiple inside bars. This is one to watch for tomorrow. If we have a break of 182.88, it's a bear break. A break of 186.48 is a bull break. Multiple inside bars tells us that this hourly chart is just seeing higher lows and lower highs and tightening and is priming for a break likely tomorrow if not tomorrow certainly on friday weekly time frame bulls battling to hold this middle bollinger band a loss of that level we did close just on it just under it a couple times in july but you can see the vast majority of 2017 this is held bulls want to hold this level and not see a bearish tcg cross tesla on the daily time frame clear bull break we had a triple bottom down at 300 and 301 the low 300s and then the bulls broke the double top the last two days at 308 they then broke 3 1070 and closed up at the high of the day with increasing bull volume and momentum in their favor so it's a strong move here key resistance is 320 if we don't break that it's just another lower high break of 320 is going to start shifting things this weekly time frame has been looking more and more like a bear flag but if we break 320 that may not be the case we're testing these equal these exponential resistances right now on the weekly and if it's all really about that 320 level by the end of the week. Bears want to see a rejection under that level and a, head, a move back down under the middle Bollinger Band on the daily. So important day coming up for the Bulls to see follow through. Excuse me. Trying to see follow through and break 320 tomorrow. CMG on the daily time frame with a bear break of the inside bar at the end of the day. We close down near the low of the day, showing that the bears have momentum. Support is 309.79, and then we're looking down to 300 psychological. The low bear volume tells us this is healthy consolidation for the bulls, and we're looking for a higher low on the daily time frame to form, and a bullish reversal candlestick to help indicate when that higher low has formed. So the bears in control of the short term, but anticipating that bulls are going to show up in the near term future for that higher low to form. The weekly time frame is a huge upper wick of profit taking with the double top 332 and 333.33. So the bulls on the weekly are likely going to have to pull back, establish a higher low, get over the middle Bollinger Band more clearly and form a higher high by clearing this double top for a more significant trend change on this weekly time frame. So that's where we stand heading into tomorrow. Multiple inside bars to be watching with Netflix looking good in terms of a clear signal coming. I appreciate you watching and we'll see you tomorrow.